Another round of child tax credit payment is on its way and be in the know as the recall election nears. That and more coming up. Happy Friday, everyone. I'm Diana San Juan filling in for Abby. Let's get you synced in. The FDA has authorized and the CDC recommends an extra dose of Pfizer or Moderna COVID-19 vaccines in people with weakened immune systems, which is about 2.7% of adults in the U.S. The purpose of the so-called booster shot is to get the protection level up to where it should be. So who is eligible and what does this mean for those who got the Johnson & Johnson vaccine? We have some answers for you on our trending bar under COVID-19 booster shots. As Governor Gavin Newsom's recall election nears, we want to make sure voters are all up to speed on what it's all about. Now, first of all, the date is set for September 14th, which gives us all about a month to get informed. We have a breakdown of everything you need to know from what a recall means to a timeline of events, information about other candidates, and even quotes straight from the governor. You can check all that out, go to our trending bar and click Newsom Recall. The IRS sent a second round of child tax credit payments this Friday, giving parents an average of a little over $400. Now this payment is set to continue through the end of the year, and we show you dates of when additional payments will go out, how to qualify, and how to track it, all on NBCBayArea.com. That's all for me, guys. Thank you so much for joining me this week. Abby will be back on Monday. Have a great weekend.